This video is how to seal a crown of a chimney. This is where it leaks. Most of the times, water gets into these cracks. The, 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 from the cement slab, the crown, to the brick, this is what's cracked open. And then sometimes the water gets in there, that cracks open too. So let me show you how to seal it. Very, very simple. It's like a three minute video. First of all, you do turbo poly seal. This is a very dirty can because I've been using it all day. But you, you cover this top of your crown with turbo poly seal, just like this. Let me show you, just like this, okay? Right into that corner. So the, it will bond into the cement, this turbo poly seal. It's amazing product. So then, get it into that crack there, like that, and get it on a brick face this side. Let me show you. I get it on a brick face about an inch and a half or so. I cover that. This is brown, but it will discolor to a light brown if you don't, uh, have, if it stays in the sun, the UVs will get it. So. You can leave it like this, it will last eight to 10 years. But now, let me show you what I do. I put, um, I put a fleece over that edge because otherwise it will keep on cracking. I put that over the fleece, make sure the wind doesn't pick it up. And that's it. I paint over that and this crown will never, never leak again there. Just like that, okay? Now, this is not the final step. If you really want this to last a long, long time, I'll show you the next step. Let me just cover this cement out. I'm, I'm gonna cover this. You see there where the cement is cracked there? The water gets scooped in right there. And see this as well here. Water gets scooped in there. So you gotta cover this. So let me do this. Show you how this is done. And then if it's not aesthetically wronged, you can paint it with any color. If you don't like the brown, the brown's gonna fade. It's not gonna stay brown like that. But um, let me do this side so you can get an idea. Because this is the most damaging part of a chimney is this crown because it leaks all the time. So you get it into that corner there. I get it into that corner, see there, right there. I put it on the whole thing. But in this transition here, right here at the edge, I put a piece of fleece. All right, there you go. The wind is getting to the bed over. All right, so you cover this with fleece, just like that. And that transition will never crack again. Now, look at it. Beautiful. This is a flexible, pliable, it sticks to cement. It will bond into the cement. So it's, it's pliable, it's flexible. Get this corner. So now, the next step, I want to show you, you can paint this any color, but let me show you the next step. After about an hour or so when it's cured, I'll show you the next step, how to make this never, never to go bad. The UVs will beat this up. But there's one more crack here. Let me show you here. This one crack here. I'm going to fix that crack. So always find cracks and then fix it. So I cut the piece of fleece, just like that. I uh, take my turbo poly seal. And I cover the crack like that. You see the crack covered like that. And then I put my fleece over that. See how fast you can do it? Any, any crack, there's no need. But caulking will never work. So you have to do it with something with a fleece. So, and I put my, and that's it. Look at it, voila. So this is one more step after that. Once I'm done here, I'm gonna show you the final step. So that's it, I fixed the crack, I fixed the crown, and now 
I have to wait for it to cure a little bit and then we I'll show you what I do after that okay thumbs up please all right so after an hour this is touch dry see that beautiful transition is done so there's one more step and the step is to protect the turbo poly seal from uh, ultraviolet and that's what you have to do you can paint it any color but the silver coat protection is the best it's aluminum asphalt paint and you paint this over the transition like that and look at it beautiful this will never go bad you'll never have that concrete crack again on this chimney so the chimney cap and crown is now complete with the final step with adding a silver coat protection over turbo, turbo poly seal and look at it that way you'll never have to do it again you can do it on the patch here look at it so it protects the, from the ultraviolet see hey i hope i've earned your subscription and thumbs up from silver coat protection i hope you can do your own chimney and protect it you can see it can be a bad chimney and it still will be good look at it that's it you see that beautiful 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 so do the flashing on the chimney same thing just like that and uh, you never have to do it again that's the final step in fixing this chimney chimney flashing look at that unbelievable very nice product all right thank you thank you thank you for that thumb